Hey guys, how's it going? DUJ2 here, and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Unchained Key. Um, this video is going to be talking about Young Kyrie. So, for those of you who don't know, Young Kyrie is the newest medal that we have available uh, from the Sinister Suites, I believe it is called. Um, Spiteful new raid boss. I think it's called Sinister Suites. Spiteful Sweets. This one, okay, the one before was Sinister. This is Spiteful Sweets. Um, so the important thing that I want to talk about here is something very important that a lot of people have already found out, but I know a lot of people don't know about yet. And this is what it says. Um, basically, uh, defeat the Spiteful Sweet Raid boss with your friends and earn raid coins to get Young Sora and Riku medals along with other great rewards. So those two medals are going to be inside of the event boards uh, of the uh, the raid boards. I'll show you guys later. Uh, and at level 30, and for every level after that, uh, sorry, and then for every 10 levels after, those who participate in defeating the Spiteful Sweets will be rewarded with a Young Kyrie medal, which is this medal here. Okay, so the way we understand it then is you have to get yours to level 30, okay? And then every 10 levels after, uh, anyone who participates, that means anyone who joins in on it would get a Kyrie medal, right? A young Kyrie medal. That is not the case. Uh, so what I want to show you guys is right now our party has been super awesome. They've been jumping a lot. Look, there's someone with level 40 right now. Ducky's got a level 58. Uh, and I just got mine to level 30. So what I'm going to show you guys is I'm going to go in here. Um, and I already have it ready to go. So we're going to go in here. I'm going to tap it because I'm going to be the host. And then I'm going to tell everyone in my party to jump on it. And, and just whoever defeats it first defeats it first. Um, the reason for doing this is because there is a mistake in that notice. Uh, the way the notice reads, it makes you believe, um, it makes you believe that every 10 levels after, so let's say, um, a level 30 up to 90, right? So that's six, right? 30, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, seven. There's seven right there. Okay. So, um... So seven of them. So if you if you get your own personal one to level 90, you will get enough to guilt. Okay? You'll get enough to guilt it. Um, and that's great. But the way the notice reads, let's read it again. The way the notice reads, it tells you that uh, not only are you going to get it, but everyone who participates, those who participate, that is not the case. Let me show you why that's not the case. If we go and tap on it, look what it says here. Victory. Raid coins, 40. MVP and host, Kyrie. All points defeated. Okay. So the way it looks, it does not look like everyone who participates is going to get the, Ky the kid Kyrie. It's going to be just the MVP and the host, which is why... Uh, I've asked everyone right now in my party to just take this one out. I want them to take it out really quick, and I want to show you guys the proof of what that means. Uh, let's go over here real quick. Pro it's probably already dead. <laughs> no, it's not yet. Wow. And this, there's a level 40 here too. I kind of wish I could jump on this, but the way that our party's doing it, uh, and huge thanks to the coordinators in my party, uh, Miss Mew Mew and Miss D, <coughs> Miss DHE. So Miss Mew Mew has been coordinating us all uh, so that we can all share this. So that way. If it's fair, if you get your own to level 90, you'll be able to guilt it, but then you can also get a couple extra ones. Now, the other thing that, that I don't know about yet, and I don't know if anyone out there can help me with this, uh, is that it does say that there's also a chance of Young Kyrie dropping from level 96 and higher. Um, I don't have one to 96. I don't think anyone in our party has a level 96 yet, so I don't know what the odds are. Is it still MVP host? Is it just a chance? And I'm pretty sure it's... No, it's not dead yet. Wow. People are still trying to take it out. Okay, let's go over and take out. Let's check the raid boards right now. Okay. Uh, so from what someone said, it's going to take about 10,000 to complete all the raid boards. Um, oh, I don't know. That that looks like a lot there. Okay, well, you know what? I haven't even I haven't even checked these raid boards. Can we even guilt this one? Young sword. Okay. One, two. Sorry. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. Okay, so we get seven total. Oh, there we go. Yeah. All right. Uh, yeah. So we get just enough to guilt him. 
I'm not exactly sure what this metal does yet. I should have completed it. Anyway, let's see if mine's done yet. There it is. <laughs> okay. So, um, there you go. So, <laughs> Ducky with that outfit. Uh, so, I was the host, so I got one. And Ducky was the MVP, so she got one. Um, this is... It's a little bit of a mistake. Uh, actually, I think it's a big mistake. Um, because... The, again, the way it reads, it reads that everyone who participates, it's kind of like the Chippendales, where if you guys remember on the Chippendales, every 10 levels, everyone who taps it gets a Chippendale. So I kind of feel like they meant, they, they, they probably took that wording over when they should have been very clear in saying that only the MVP and host. So um, because of this, I mean, I want to make this video for everyone out there to get a good chance to do this because um, don't wait. Uh, if you wait then or if coordinate with your party if you have a very small party and only a couple of active people between you guys you can share them you can mvp them but if you are going to focus on your own and just grind up your own you're kind of losing that one Kyrie potential Kyrie. um we don't know how difficult it's going to be to guilt her you know what let's go take a look at the metal too okay um so she is raises strength and defense of all attributes by one tier for one turn. Huh. Interesting. Raises strength of all defense in defense of all attributes by one tier for one turn. Uh, so I'm guessing maybe that's the same thing that uh, Kitsora and Riku do. I don't know. Let me know down below. Um, and also, if you already have one at level 96, please let me know down below. Or if you have one at 99, you're already grinding. I'm sure someone already has them at 99. Um, let us know how often you get one. Is it something you get every single time? Is it just once every 10 times that you get one? Um, I'm very curious to see just... And how difficult are those level 99s? I'm very curious to see just what they've done to us here. Um, again, I'm glad that we saw this very early on in our party. Uh, and I'm glad that people have caught on to this. Uh, because if you wait till the last minute, you're not going to be able to guilt this medal. Not sure if it's worth guilting it. But you know what? If you don't... Uh, you know what? It's a, not a bad medal. It's actually not a bad medal. It's AoE. It's not a bad medal. Definitely, if you have it high, if max guilted, it could definitely help you out. Uh, combine this with the Santasaurus, you know, and a couple there. Two Santasaurus, two of these, and one of the World of Final Fantasy medals. Or like a... Uh, um, what's it called? Um, you could have several. Yeah, you could have Zigbar B if you got it. Um, you can have uh, Marlufa, Marley B. Um, there's a lot of different medals. Um, <laughs> Zigbee. Uh, there's a lot of different medals that you could that you could possibly combine in this kind of a setup. Uh, and this is a good one. I mean, um, up one up strength and um, wait raises. Raises strength and defense of all attributes. Oh, my strength and defense. Okay, so it's my strength and defense. It doesn't lower the defense of, of the enemy. Okay, that's good to know. So it raises my strength and my defense. I'm sorry about that. Um, it's still good. It's still a pretty good medal. And it's a cool medal, you know. Um, I'm really I'm really grateful and happy for our party who really jumps all together and we're working really hard together to get this done. Um, I now have three. I'm going to have to keep going and see what else I can get. Uh, definitely something that we need to work together as. You need to work together as a team. I'm going to keep grinding mine, trying to get to my next 10 level. Uh, and then just keep going. That. I want to definitely try and get mine to level 90. Um, and I hope that everyone out there can also, you know, coordinate with your parties. Figure out how to get these done properly. Uh, and definitely, I really hope that they fix this. I hope they fix this because the way this reads, it really, really is... Um, Basically, it's telling you that if you're playing by yourself, you're going to have to get to 90. You're going to have to get your raid boss to 90 to be able to um, to be able to guilt that metal. And if you don't get it to 90, um, then you're going to have to be working very hard with your party early on in the week to be able to get it up there. So I hope this helps everyone. Thank you very much for watching, guys. As always, I am DUJ2. Uh, this has been... The new Spiteful Sweets. That is a very, very good name for it. <laughs> the Spiteful Sweets. Um, I know there's going to be a lot of spite over this. And I hope that they I hope that they make it right. So Square Enix, if you're watching, you got to make this right. Um, 
definitely help out the people who who you know who are playing differently and if you're not part of a very active party this is going to be a very difficult thing for you so thank you very much for watching guys as always i am duj2 and i'll see you guys next time see ya